You can do this. Damon. This is what gonna be... What the hell are you doing here? Uh, use the knife. I've got your money. Can we talk about this? I've got your money right here. The money James owes you? How the fuck do you... Run! No one has to know. Just... Just let her go, and I won't say... Oh, Jesus! Oh, really? The knife just popped out of her pocket? Talking's over. Leave her alone! Shut up. What the fuck? <clears throat> He's gonna see that it was me texting him. You boosted the DA's shit? Got my money? Burned the evidence? All that? I'm just trying to help. Oh. Get away from her. Ouch. I said shut the fuck up. Well, this guy's a real winner. What's he doing? No. What's he doing? Go oh, he injected her. Fucking happy place. Right. Let this be a lesson, kid. Make good life choices, or you'll end up like her. Now, what do I do with- Damon! What did you do? Ho 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 I fucked you up good, didn't I? Guess you really don't know when to quit. Glad to see you back on your feet. Chloe. Man, this is just a big mess. Just people writhing in pain everywhere. You don't really want to do this again, do you? Okay. Then I don't want to do this again. Come on, man. Fuck you. Sarah. Rachel. Your daughter. She... Oh boy, what the heck happens while I was asleep now? Sarah? Chloe Price. Uh, I'm assuming that I'm dreaming. Where's Frank? Or, or Damon? Your friend, Frank, took care of Damon. What does that mean? You don't need to worry about them right now. Sit. Frank killed Damon? Am I dreaming? Is this real? Why are you sitting there, smoking a cigarette? Sarah, are you okay? We need to talk about what happened. About what happened? I am so, so sorry for- Rachel can never know. About what? What exactly can't Rachel know? What James did. Hiring that thug. Shooting me up with- <sighs> He's a piece of shit. And I promise that- Rachel can never know. Ah, <sighs> okay. Tell me why. Doesn't she deserve to know what her father did? No. Rachel deserves a loving father. A father who cares he for her. He does. She just went a little a too James far. is a desperate man who loves his daughter. And she loves him. Tell her what happened here. And you'll take that away from her. She's right. Forever. Um. And just, what is James protecting her from? You? She wants to meet you, Sarah. No, she doesn't. She wants to meet her mother. I can never be that for her. Why are you saying all this? Because James is right. He's taken something from me that I might not ever get back. 
But he's right. I'm broken. You're strong. Everybody's broken. Everybody's broken, Sarah. Oh? Does everybody abandon their own child for 15 years? Does everybody take money to stay away? I, I do. I don't know about you. You're here now. That was a joke. I don't take any money to That's stay away from my matters. children. I don't even have any children. And I'm going to stop talking. You know? I know Rachel needs you. I know loss. I lost my father two years ago. How? Car accident. He was... He was picking up my mother from the grocery store, and a truck ran a red light, and that was it. I'm sorry. You don't know what this is to me. Every pain. Every fear. Gone. No more sadness. No more grief. Why would anyone not want to feel that way? Ever. You quit for a year. Rachel needs you. I heard what Damon said. You've been sober for a year. You beat this before. You can beat it again. No. I can't. I, I recognize I might not know what the fuck I'm talking about here, but I just... I wish you could know how amazing Rachel is. I know. She's fearless. She's brilliant and talented. And she feels so much. She's so strong. She's had a good life. Raised in a loving home, given opportunities I could never give her. At least talk to her. She's felt like something's been missing her whole life. She told me so. That something was you. She didn't miss anything. She has a perfect family. They are far from perfect. I thought my dad was perfect. Why would she say that? How do you know her dad isn't perfect? Let's just go with they're far from perfect. Even without all this shit, the Ambers are far from perfect. James is an elitist asshole and, and Rose lets him walk all over her. Maybe. What Rachel needs, though, is not to have her father taken away from her. <sighs> he doesn't it's deserve- It's not about James. It's not about me, and it's not about you. It's about Rachel. Tell her what James did, and you'll be killing him for her. You understand that, don't you? I do, you but Chloe doesn't seem to understand that. Do you really want to put Rachel through that? I can't lie to her. Don't you want to see her? Oh, these are none of the options that I want to actually... Mm. Don't you want to see her? You came here for it. You got sober. You deserve the chance to know your daughter. Nothing can change the mistakes I made. I'll never get to be Rachel's mother. Not really. But there's one thing I can still do for her. The only thing I can do. Let me give her the father she deserves. Oh my god, we've this the is like one who we've been over her. this. I'm totally cool her. with you saying that. The one Chloe who isn't. loves her more than anything. You can do whatever you want, Chloe. You have the power. 
What you have to decide is whether you're going to protect Rachel or cause her even more hurt. That's an easy decision for me. So please, tell her I was never here. Let her have what peace she can without me. Wait. Don't leave. I'll take care of her. I'll take care of her. I'll take care of her, you know. I believe you. Goodbye, Chloe. Apparently she didn't take care of her because, spoiler alert, she's dead. Oh, back at the hospital, okay. And I guess this is where we gotta make the decision whether we tell her or not. Easy decision for me. Hello? How are you? Hi, Chloe. Are Rachel's just fallen asleep. Sorry. I know she'll be thrilled to see you when she wakes up. Maybe come back a little later? Hey. Oh, she's awake. Go back to sleep, kiddo. You need your rest. Can I talk to Chloe? Alone? For a minute? Okay, sweetie. We'll be right outside. Well, here's the thing, Rachel. How are you feeling? Like I got stabbed? <laughs> Doc says there'll be a sick scar. Maybe a tattoo is in order. Fuck yeah. We never actually escaped. Did we? Nope. We've got time. All the time in the world. So, how did everything go? Well, it's complicated. I think a couple people are dead, or one person at least is dead. Rachel, I've got to tell you something. Tell Rachel everything. Protect Rachel from the truth. We're protecting her. It's better for her to not know. Easy decision for me. I don't know what you guys it's would think. Wrong. I failed you. I couldn't find her. I'm so sorry. Funny. You seem so confident. I really thought you'd find her. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. You know, just uh, Me too. When stuff happens and um, just, just couldn't do it. Maybe we can try tomorrow. M maybe she hasn't left town yet. No, she left. I heard. I heard. Um, I heard that she left from people. people I know. Told me she's gone. Wherever she is, she loves you very much. Yeah, I, I don't know this because I spoke to her How? personally. I just, I just get the feeling. Do you know? Just that? get the feeling. Just have a feeling that she, she loves you. It's a strong feeling, almost as if I was talking to her and she told because me. almost like that. Why should she be any different from the rest of us? Oh, that's adorable. That was pretty smooth, Chloe. Gotta admit. They're having dinner together. Mm. 
And they seem like a happy family. Oh, Chloe's not. Oh, Frank's got the puppy. He's putting away the knife that he probably killed Damon Merrick with. Yeah, this is the end. This is right before the original Life is Strange starts, I'm pretty sure, because he has that puppy in that. It's been such a long time since... Okay. I mean, that's not exactly a romantic way to do it. You come and propose to your, your fiancé in the kitchen while she's cooking. Chloe doesn't seem very happy with it. This kid. This kid just lost his marbles. Hey, good to see uh, football guys feeling better. Nice roll, bro. And he's having a bagel. It's lunchtime for me now, so I feel like I want to have a little, little something myself. There's Nathan. Dude, you just stood there like a chump. Victoria. Chloe sitting outside. <laughs> the principal with a, a a shake of disapproval. Oh, and she flipped him the bird. Oh my goodness. It sucks to be you, principal. Uh, what's his name now? I'm so bad with names. Oh, and this is where the first one starts, isn't it? By the lighthouse? Adorable. That's Chloe's room, isn't it? All blue! It's happening! Or no, it's like a... It's like a cool fade sort of thing. Oh, they're, they're planning out where they're gonna travel to. Uh-huh. like teaching her how to tag stuff she probably is yep well we was here Rachel was here good good creativity are they comparing their tattoos Having a great time. Stick it out together, like we always do. Oh, there's no one, there's no one quite like you. That's it. 
that's the end of episode three, and that's pretty. I'm pretty sure that's the final episode, by the way. Hope you guys enjoyed it. It was good. It was interesting. It was quite the story. I'm not sure. I still am not sure if I like these characters very much. Like, Chloe seemed like she got everybody into a lot of trouble. Rachel was kind of reckless and stuff. But, hey, you know, it was. Uh, it's probably an accurate portrayal of what teenage life was like back in the day. I have no idea. Uh, let's see how we did. Okay, so we were about split. We didn't tell Rachel the truth. We were in a slight majority. I attacked... 64%. Uh, we were kind to Joyce, 63%. We defended Nathan, 86%. You told Rachel you were just friends. Oh, ew, I was in the minority there. Turned out okay for us, though. Uh, we were in the minority here. We went along with Rachel's story in the minority. Okay. You refused to empty your pockets in the minority. Okay. You stayed with Mikey. You stayed with Mikey. You gave Damon the money. You stayed with... Oh, wow. We were... Okay, yeah. Yeah, that's... No, that's good. You asked... Rachel for a kiss. We were definitely in the majority there. Okay. Uh, you told Rachel the truth. Yeah. Okay. That's the beginning again. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Oh, wait. There's a little clip. What's this? We're taking pictures? Good poses, girls. Ah, oh, adorable. You. Chloe calling 17 missed calls Oh man this is after After stuff went down This is Nathan This is while Nathan's doing his thing And uh And murdering her Spoiler alert. I mean, you should have watched the first one by now. That's it. We're done. Well, bonus episode. Thanks for playing. Don't miss the bonus farewell episode available on the deluxe edition. There's a farewell episode? Interesting. I don't have that episode. Unless it's something else. Um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the series. I'm not sure I'll play more of this series, to be honest with you. I really like the story, but it seems you guys don't really have much interest in it. I don't know. Maybe. It all depends on when it's released. And if I have nothing else going on with my channel, I might play it. But... For now, it seems you guys have kind of moved on to uh, to different stories. Hope you enjoyed it regardless, th those of you that stuck it out. And um, I'll see you in some other series, perhaps. Thanks. Bye-bye.